horrible job. Doesn't know how to cut wood. Oh, hey. Didn't see you there. I was just uh, chopping some wood. What is up, guys? Happy Friday. Merry Christmas. When I'm not chopping wood and being a complete mountain man, I am serving up them drinks. And today, folks, we have made it to the fourth drink. Got my gloves because it is cold as ice balls out here. And we're gonna make some drinks right now, some holiday drinks. These are special Christmas drinks um, from my grandmother's recipe book, Passed Down. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, it's backwards. <laughs> All right. You're gonna get it. You're gonna get it. You're gonna get it. So we're going to the liquor store, me and grandma, to purchase our liquor for the brand new smashes. Alright guys, I'm here at Grandma Kathy's place. We are getting ready to work on the brand new smashes. Brandy Smashes is a drink that grandma's been making for years, decades. I remember they're making this at large Christmas parties when I was a kid, so I'm excited to make it for you guys. Nine cups of water, two cups of sugar. Uh, I'm not gonna do it this way. <laughs> You're gonna amend the recipe a little bit? Well, I'm not gonna boil nine cups of water where I can get by with two and put ice water in. So normally we take nine cups, but because of shortage of time, we're just going to do four uh, to boil, and then we'll add the rest of the water that we need later. Ice water. Ice water. Yeah. But I've never tried brandy like this. It's absolutely delicious. And then we have the Bacardi. You saw my old video. I had that Christian Brothers, and that's what my mom uses. <laughs> too. Oh. Grandma's not a fan of the Christian Brothers. That's the cheap stuff, Grandma. I like the smooth, expensive <laughs> stuff. And then, of course, we have our lemonade, our can of concentrate, frozen lemonade, and frozen orange juice. Let this dissolve in the hot water, in the hot syrup, in the hot sim simple syrup. Okay, here's the brandy. So it's kind of like a brandy and rum smash. It's called brandy smash, though. So two cups of each, basically. What we're going to do is add the ice water that we didn't put in so it gets cold right away. So if you do it like this, you can have brandy smash for several parties over the holidays. Some people have a big stressful family. You might go through all these jars in one night. We have done that when <laughs> we had the last Christmas you were with the whole family, we went through an entire batch. In one night. At Matt and Danielle's, yeah. We had a lot of people there. Out to the garage, where it's very cold out because last night we had a good freeze. Okay, now I'm just putting the top shot. I know it's cold again hmm. And then how long are we leaving it in there for? Until it's froze, and it won't be froze solid. It will just be froze. It'll be slushy because the alcohol doesn't freeze. And then you mix it half and half with Sprite. All right. My grandmother was actually talking a little bit of shit when she saw my last few videos, especially the eggnog one. She was saying I suck at making eggnog drinks, so we're gonna see grandma's updated version. So we actually got two drinks coming for you guys. For my white elephant gift, I got eyeglass cord. So y'all gonna see me rocking these. Fresh to death. Mm. Oh my, and now it's really fizzing up. It is liquor, it is an eggnog though. Yeah, man, that is good. <laughs> mm. Ah, perfect. So that's the secret, huh? Yeah, don't water it down with ice for Pete's sakes. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I saw that and I thought, are you really putting that out there like that, Jacob? Okay. <laughs> Take a glass. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, man. <laughs> See the difference? <laughs> <laughs> That's the best thing I've ever had.
Grandma, I think the brand smashes already. Let's see if we're ready. Put it in here for, it's been at least seven hours now. Probably better if it's all night, but I'm ready to drink, so here we are. All right, it looks pretty frozen to me. Not completely, but I think that's good enough to make a drink with. All right, so we have our brandy smashes, grandma's <laughs> special recipe. Okay. We're gonna scrape out the slush, the brandy slush. Halfway there. Fizz. I know how to let the fizz out. Yeah. Like a pro. So let's top this baby off with some spray. A little bit more stir here. <laughs> and then, the most important step. Can you drink it? <laughs> no. Cheers! Cheers! Let's try this. Mm. Delicious. Gosh, it's stuck up in there. Let good. it snow, let it snow, let it snow. <laughs> wrong, 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 wrong. All right, the party starter is here. Let's try this brandy. Here's my <laughs> smash. Let's see how it turned out. So the batch mix, how much do we say it made? About 20 cups? Yeah, it's 20 cups. So it's enough for a large Christmas party, even though we're not supposed to be doing large gatherings right now, enough for a couple people to have a great long night and get brandy smashed. So after COVID, we can have a large party. And vitamin C. And not only are you getting your alcohol, but you're getting your vitamin C, so it's helping fight COVID at the same time. Now we wanna go. Go ahead. Thanks for tuning in. You guys have a Merry Christmas oh. and a Happy New Year. <laughs>